Hello and welcome to my paper craft channel. Today I would like to use a wood texture designer to use paper, it's a double side paper, as well as large letters frame list. Today I'm gonna make a thanks card. So um, I'm gonna pick the uh, letters thanks and I'm gonna use a old olive piece of cardstock for leaves. This is very vanilla uh, thick cardstock. This is uh, A4 uh, cut in half and fold in half. And I'm picking one of the wood uh, texture DSP. And I'm going to place my letters on the DSP. I'm going to uh, place that on the left side so uh, you can have a piece of um, paper uh, for uh, the card. So I'm put that in a big shot machine. I'm do that on the out of the camera. And now I take the all letters. And the outstanding uh, DSP, I'm gonna cut a piece of paper. I think it's just above, just, yeah, just a little bit than one uh, inches. And I'm going to take the piece of paper and uh, the lay stream. I'm going to take a fast fuse and I put um, a fast fuse on the one of the edge and I stick there my lay stream. You can take that off if it's not straight, like you can see on my video. And I'm going to put again. Try this time to be perfect. That's it. I'm going to cut the axis with my scissors. And I'm going to stick to my card base. Did I say that it's very vanilla thick cardstock? I think I did. I'm going to take a Tombow. And I glue that in the front of my card. I like a Tombow because you can uh, make it the ma maneuver. You can see on the left side, this is not to the top, so I just move it. Now, look, yes. And I'm gonna trim the axis from the both side. And then now I'm gonna take my letters, just put that on the order, and I'm going to stick with the foam adhesive strip. They are quite thin. They are quite long. Very good for letters. So now I'm going to take my scissors and I put on a very quick, I don't know how to say. Anyway, as I think it's times for speed, oh, speed. And then put it all letters for the S is a little bit harder and now I'm gonna stick all the letters to my card base you cannot really stick them uh, straight because the uh, card base is a smaller um, it's a normal size, but um, to put the letters like straight, you need to uh, have a longer card. So, but if you put like me, up and down, up and down, they're going to be fit properly. And there's the last letter. And uh, now I'm going to take the uh, leaf punch. And I'm going to punch two leaves. And I'm going to take the daisy punch. And we need to punch two daisies. And now we have to take a scissors and uh, cut off the petals. And 
And from the outstanding uh, wood texture, we need to punch two uh, circle. I think it's a half inch circle. And now I'm gonna take my tombow and just stick the petals all around the circle. Like you can see, I'm going to make a daisy, but a smaller version of daisy. <laughs> so just put a glue and a stick again, and I put a glue and a stick again. And on the top, I put another one circle. So there is my circle, there is my wee daisy. Uh, the leaves, I'm going to distress, like you can see. And uh, I'm going to take uh, my bone folder and... Uh, um, curl the uh, uh, petals to the, give it the dimension and I'm gonna take again tombo and I stick the leaves and my uh, mini daisy is ready just uh, keep it to the glue And I'm gonna top on a put on the top left of my card. And that is card ready. Just take a time to the glue to set up. Oh my gosh, I just love it. So thanks for watching me. All suppliers are linked below in the video description as well as on my blog. And I thank you very much for the time. And I see you again soon. Bye!